But I just been contacted that Bonjour, guten Tag. What's up, bruh? something work on my stamina so that's why we're gonna go out on the pitch but right I feel like sometimes my life is like a movie literally there are so many things happening always either good or bad but we just keep going that's what I do always that's how my parents raised me to keep going and enjoy life take each day as it comes as you never know if you're gonna wake up tomorrow only God knows trust in God pray eat healthy and live your dreams that's it and my friends who commended me porridge with orange juice and banana did you guys ever try it? Porridge with orange juice and banana. I'm about to try it, but I'm not sure. I'm not sure. <laughs> yeah, that's all right. That's all right. But I prefer my normal porridge. Yeah, definitely prefer my normal porridge. I think the most difficult part every single time when I do those extras is to motivate yourself to just go out and just do it and train so what we're gonna do today is so the pitch we're gonna do 10 doggies so what we do is from touch line to six yards back 18 yards back halfway back other goal line and back and this 10 times and after that we do because when you when you divide this pitch in like lines there's going to be one two to halfway three four five six so it's going to be six lines what we're going to do is so we run one line one line fast one line slow two line fast one line slow three line fast one line slow four line fast and so on and we do this like two rounds so it's going to be tough but we just do it and sometimes i even think why am i doing this like why why am i doing all those extras because my schedule is monday training tuesday match like the last two months monday training tuesday match Wednesday's off but if I have a match on Tuesday like obviously I take my day off but I still do my core workout or something but and then Thursday training Friday training Saturday match Sunday off but yesterday we didn't have a match so that's why but we had training but I still do something and of course it's hard of course I'm thinking sometimes am I doing too much am I over training does that make sense? Because I just I just scored six goals now. But if I would be really good enough, maybe I should have scored more goals. Like all those questions come into my mind. And But as I said, the way I've been raised up, if I want to achieve big things, you need to train big. So I just do it. So that's why let's do it.
that I'm a good cook. Oh yes, oh yes. Let me introduce to you. He's a friend of mine. Brown rice, prawns and broccoli. Da, da, da. Pepper, wow. Black beans and spinach. Such a beautiful girl walking down the streets. <laughs> in the library now in Birmingham because I'm about to work on my clothing brand and if you guys want to create your own brand your own business you need to know it's a lot of hard work but I'm excited because it's my, it's like my baby. So I'd really try to make it online. But later on, we're gonna meet as well Mr. Tweedy because there's Champions League tonight that I'm really looking forward to as well. But let's do work first and then the enjoyments come later. Who get this is the top guy? Who go from him? He'd go bang. No, no, it was from him. Bang across and then middle. <laughs> come on, Team Brandao. <laughs> team Brandao. Come on. As you guys know, football world is so quick and there are so many things happening. In my case, I'm on loan to another club. Scored so far six goals in. I think over 13 or 14 matches, so that's all right. But I've just been contacted that there's another club interested in, in loaning me out for another month. Like I didn't expect that, but that's how it is. Because the most important thing in football is to play games. And I'm more than thankful that in the last two months, I played so many matches and I always started the game. I always been in the starting 11 and I don't really focus on where I play. I mean, I just want to play. That's the most important thing because by playing games, that's when you improve. And I feel like I improved a lot. So that's why I'm looking forward to, to new challenges, new things that are coming my way. And finally, finally, Boguva clothing is online. You guys can get my t-shirts finally. Boguvaclothing.com Hey, this is so surreal. Finally, it's online. Finally. But make sure you check it out. Boguvaclothing.com And I'm going to do loads of giveaways so that you guys can have some t-shirts or jumpers like for free. So that's why, but we're heading to the right direction and I'm going to upload more often. You guys are going to see my highlights very, very soon because I played some matches that I think you guys want to see highlights how I played. All the glory to God because God is good and no matter what you want to achieve. I mean, who have thought of two years ago that I'm going to have my own clothing line? Even that it's just like, it's just at the beginning, but that's why you never know where life takes you. Through this YouTube, through everything, like, now I have my own clothing line. This is, this is crazy, but we keep going, we keep going. And also, very, very important, with all this coronavirus going on, make sure you clean your hands. Make sure you wash your hands, because... Football is being cancelled. I think Premier League, all those kind of things, they are, they are cancelled. Or like Champions League matches are played with no fans. Like, so make sure you wash your hands. Twenty seconds with soap or disinfection, like spray. Like, make sure you take care of you because you never know what's going to happen. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed watching today's video. Make sure you subscribe if you haven't already. Smash that like button, guys. Keep in mind, when you believe, everything 
is mm, possible. So team Brandao, mm, I'll see you next time. <laughs>